If you want to know how to put on the Breg Policare Wave pads, you came to the right spot. We're going to show you how to do it step by step, fast and easy. Hi, it's Steve from My Cold Therapy, where we help people get back to living. If you're new here, make sure you click on that subscribe button and all the links to everything we mentioned in the video in the description box below. Let's jump right into it. Cold therapy is an awesome way to help relieve your pain and swelling after surgery or an injury or just a hard day of being a weekend warrior. So how do you properly use the cold therapy device? Well, I'm going to show you the proper way how to do this end to end. And once we're done, I'm going to show you the number one trick to make your cold therapy experience easier. All right. How do we do this? Michelle, take us through the steps of the application of the Breg Policare Wave pads. The first thing we need to do is make sure that the pad and the part number are correct. You would do this by looking at the front right corner of the pad where the part number will be listed on the white label. Notice this is a sealed bag and once the sealed bag has been opened it cannot be returned and the universal protocol for cold therapy is 20 minutes on 20 minutes off. Also, please make sure to check with your doctor for any other instructions while you're using the cold therapy device, just to be on the safe side. Today, we're gonna to show you how to apply the Bragg Polar Care Wave shoulder pad. As you can see, it does not require a sterile dressing. However, you should always check with your doctor on ways to check your skin for signs of redness or irritation. So the long part is going to attach to the top of the pad you're going to put it in place over the shoulder. Then you're going to bring around the long strap and attach it to the top here. Once we've done that, we're going to attach our bicep strap. And then once you have it in place, you can go ahead and loosen or tighten it depending on your need. Once that's in place, take the hose from your cooler and attach it to the hose on the pad. On the wave pads, there are arrows on the top of the connectors. Make sure those arrows are face up. Once you've done that, you're ready to hook it in place. You hear that little click, that means it's secure. Then you just plug in your system and you're ready to begin your therapy. Great job, Michelle, in showing us how to do that. As I mentioned earlier in the video, I'm going to show you our number one trick to help make things easier for you. We have freeze bags that you can use in the cooler. And they come in packs of 12. You place three in the cooler and the rest in the fridge, and then you just keep rotating the bags. This way, especially if you're alone, you don't have to keep chasing after ice, and your refrigerator will have a really hard time keeping up anyway. Now that you know how to use your cold therapy machine, let me know in the comments section below if you found this video helpful, and do give us a like, and also don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching, and let's get back to living.